Okay, here we are today. I am gonna clean this flower bed here. Look at this place over here. Like, I, I keep getting these jobs that um, I don't know, I guess people just see my my Facebook ads or just my Facebook page and uh, so I get to come out on a property like this for the day so anyway this is one bed I gotta clean out I was already here earlier Monday to, to do all the lawn the lawn was pretty high so again I already cut the lawn here I came out to give her a quote on Monday night at seven and I realized how long the grass was and I said well maybe it's best if I cut the lawn tonight and come back on Friday and finish the rest but uh, this area over here is probably maybe four feet in some areas um, so what I'm gonna have to do is I think I'm gonna have to get my hedge trimmer instead of the weed whacker because uh, I find that the grass just binds the the gear like the uh, the, the head and then you gotta tear all the grass out of um, just takes more time we'll see how the hedge trimmer does so and this whole area here is pretty big there's a lot of, a lot of tall grass Whoa, yeah, so this, this comes right up, so right up to there. <laughs> I don't think a weed whacker is gonna do it. Look at that, it's crazy. So, uh, hedge trimmer, definitely. So I got the articulating hedge trimmer so I can stand upright and the hedge trimmer head can actually just be level with the ground and I basically use it like a scythe, a scythe I think they're called. And uh, anyway, look at the mountains, you can see the mountains. My twin brother Jeff, I think he's been on every single mountain top there. He's a, he's a mountain climber. Anyway, um, so yeah, let's see what else, what else? Gosh, I gotta be careful how I walk over here. I fall into a hole. Okay. They're selling the house, so they want the, they want, they want it cleaned up. So this garden bed, she said, just weed whack everything down. And uh, there's just, there's nothing here. It's just gonna be rocks. So just a lot to take care of when she's busy. I think she told me she worked two jobs. Um, she's just by herself with her out here. So it's not easy. It's not easy. She's got a couple horses. Anyway, I'll get to it. Show you guys what it looks like when it's done. All right, let's put the hedge trimmer on.
working even better than I thought. I have done this before, but this was just the low stuff. Let's see what it, be excited to see what it does on the big stuff. Uh, so I did tell her, you know, if you want me to remove the grass, that's gonna be extra. So you don't wanna forget little details like that because that would take a little while. So she didn't want me to, she said just leave it. So, all right, well, I'm gonna keep going. That is a bit of a workout still, but as you can tell, it's doing a lot. But I can't think of I can't think of any other thing that would do in there. I mean, you saw it; it's four feet tall, and then there's little holes. You know, watch out for those. You know, and you don't roll your ankle. But anyway, this might take a little while, but I think this is the best way I came up with.
the towing capacity on this uh, John Deere 335. I don't know, I'll have to look up in the manual. But, um, it doesn't look like a lot, but there's five shrubs in there, two garden, and I weeded two garden beds. Uh, so yeah, so I, I have everything on a tarp. And now, I'm just gonna, there's a couple trees over there in the middle of her lawn, her field. I guess that's the spot to be, that's the spot to take it, so. I could drag the uh, tarp down there myself, but there's a better way. There's definitely a better way. That we'll didn't work. That. Looks like I'm pulling it. I don't know, that rope just didn't work with that rope. The rope wanted to snap. Anyway, I don't know what just Here we go. What do I get myself into? in this sort of burn spot in the middle of the field. Yeah, I didn't realize how much that weighed. That was probably oh, 200 pounds. All right, she wanted uh, just all the weeds pulled out of the bed. She said, you know, it didn't have to be perfect, but uh, I still wanted to, uh, you know, make sure I did a good job. It was pretty nasty, so. I kind of discovered some plants while I was in there. They're so full of weeds. Um, all right, so this is the this is where most of the well, this is where half of the work was. Okay, I don't know. Eric, there, there it is. All the grass is down. That was a bit of a workout with that hedge trimmer. So, like I said, uh, there's a lot of grass just laid over in there, but she said that was okay. So, what do you guys think? Up to my, uh, almost up to my shoulders. Now you can just walk on it. Dang it. It doesn't look that good. <laughs> like, uh, I mean, I don't know what else to do here. It looks a lot better than it did. But still, with the grass being laid over on the side like that, still, you know, maybe she'll collect it and then she'll be able to mow it finally. All right, if you guys can remember, these rocks, these were all covered in weeds too. I had to pull a couple big shrubs right out from the middle here. Right, right where you can see the landscape fabric here. A couple like, they weren't really tall, but they were uh, established. They had a big root system. It took me a while to even get it with the Sawzall. So I think she'll be happy. That was pretty ugly before. A couple tripping hazards in here. Like, uh, pretty deep hole here if you're not paying attention could fall especially in the tall grass and then all those hedges that were here that took me five minutes that's because I had the uh, sawzall and I was I just uh, I kind of dug around the base of the of the hedge those cedars and then uh, I used a sawzall with a with a really long blade, cut around it, and uh, in five minutes that would have taken me an hour and a half with a shovel. Well, I hope she's happy. It's 
Okay, so I was here today, 10.30, and it's 2.30 now. So, that is four hours, and I was I mowed it. Uh, it took me an hour and a half to mow this the, when I came here on Monday. So, that's five and a half hours, and I charged 425. So, that's not bad. What is that now? Five, five and a half hours so anyway can't do the math right now but uh, another company probably could have got more I'm a bit of a uh, I guess a hard worker I guess it was so it might take uh, I don't want to brag or anything but it might take um, two guys all day to do what I just did so um, anyway so that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. It was kind of a fun one. Uh, buried inside that tall grass. But uh, anyway. Definitely next enjoying time. some Wendy's after that job's done. Got to reward yourself. Uh, Dave's Single. That is actually a really good burger. And I like their fries. I don't go to Wendy's enough. They got good fries. They got good burgers. 99 cent uh, frost chocolate frosty. Well, you can't beat that.